Western North Carolina, of course, is known for its great Christmas trees, but now we are starting to catch up. With some trees of a different kind, an old crab pot maker in Carteret County decided to twist some of his wire into a unique Christmas tree. And tonight, News Channel 12's Mike Laquia shows us how that moment of inspiration has turned into a big business. It looks an awful lot like Santa's workshop, but down East Carteret County is a long ways from the North Pole. These Christmas helpers cut and twist crab pot wire into bright and colorful core sound Christmas trees. Nick Harvey first started his business making fishing nets, then crab pots, and now these core sound Christmas trees. The first step is flattening out the wire, then cutting it into rectangles. And once more into triangles. Mike Wells knows the wire can be very prickly. So you do a little bleeding for Santa? Oh yes, do a little bleeding for Santa. Those triangles are bound together and set on a spinning Christmas tree stand. It can take almost an hour to put all 500 lights on a six-foot tree. Now these trees are certainly easier to set up than the real ones. You simply unfold it, put a twist tie at the bottom and up here on the top, and you're done. The orders keep coming. Thousands have been sold across the country the last five years. Danny Spark has the right name to do the lights. While he's a professional, he still has to deal with common Christmas complications. Have you, have you ever put some lights on there and then found out that one of the bulbs didn't work and you had to go back? Yes, I've done that. Yes, I have done that. Many times, probably. Davis, Mike Lequia, News Channel 12.